winning point came with just six minutes left for play. Alan Demcher is hacked to the ground. And this offence proves a costly one. practicing three kicks all summer is there again Gale shoots Agrizovic is beaten this time and for Tony Gale it's his first ever goal for the Hammers take the corner and it's a great header from Tony Gale Tony Gale who, who scores his second goal for West Ham time 58 minutes getting the ball back six men in the Sheffield United wall there's the it's a goal Gale well what a way to celebrate your 25th cup tie Tony Gale makes it 4-0 67 minutes gone and that's his third goal of the season well Gale is excellent at dipping little free kicks and Brady is also lined up there. West Ham 3-1 up. And it's going to be Gale who clips it. He's got it in there. 4-1. His first goal of the season. And what a marvellous moment to get it. I said he was pretty adept at firing in that sort of free kick. And here indeed is the proof as Brady jumps over it. And there was space enough there over the wall, beyond Hooper, into the net, 4-1. And we are now heading for the sensational result of the season. Keen again. Foster gets the flick on this time. Gale with a header. Well, one fine night against Liverpool in the Rumbelows Cup, he did just that from this sort of range. Tony Gale, and he has done it again! Oh yes! Oh yes, Tony Gale! What a curler from Tony Gale! And now Gary Crosby for Forrest, up against Tony Gale, and Crosby had the pace, and Gale bumped him down. Key packet goes straight to his pocket. It's, what, 22, 23 yards out the challenge. Crosby was away from Gale, and Gale came in, and it's red. It's the, it's the cynical foul on the player in the goal-scoring opportunity. Tony Gale has been sent off the pitch in the FA Cup semi-final. What a sensation. Keith Hackett says that's the way the law is, you've got to go. And I'm not so sure that there won't be controversy about that decision. Bobby Charlton is shaking his head. Here's what happened. Did he push him? Did he bump him? Did he pull him back by the shirt? Well, he certainly went over. And West Ham United have been reduced to 10 men and Tony Gale is sent off in the FA Cup semi-final. Keen to deliver the cross. Nicely struck. Oh, and it's there, Tony Gale! 53 minutes gone. And Gale steals the lead for West Ham United.